Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today in this video we will discuss about double Medox rod test. As the name indicates, uh, we will use two Medox rod in this test. And the purpose of this test is to measure circular torsion. There are two types of circular torsions. We have uh, in torsion. and extorsion. Intorsion is a situation in which the eye moves up and inwards like this. If this is your nose, the eye will move up and inward. This is known as intorsion and in extorsion, the eye will move up and outwards like in this fashion. This is known as extorsion. So basically, uh, we use this test to measure Intorsion and extorsion. Now, talking about the procedure, uh, we need two Medox rods. We need a spotlight. And this test can be conducted at near or at distance. For near, the distance is 33 cm, and for distance, the uh, distance is 6 meters. And uh, you have to place both these medox rod vertically and uh, we know that uh, when medox rod are placed in vertical fashion the line seen by the observer uh, will be horizontal so the observer will see two horizontal lines and uh, he will be asked to fixate it the spotlight depending upon the distance at which we are doing 33 centimeter or 6 meter and uh, the observer is uh, supposed to be see two horizontal lines and uh, the lights of the room should be dim this is another uh, protocol of doing this test uh, in case of any vertical deviation the patient is supposed to be seeing these two lines as one above and one below and uh, if the patient reports that he sees two lines one above and one below then we will ask uh, uh, him to tell whether these lines are parallel or uh, any one of the line is tilted if the patient is unable to appreciate any separation between the images then you can also use uh, vertical prisms to displace one of the image and uh, when patient appreciates two images then you will ask that uh, whether these lines are parallel or tilted if the patient reports any tilt in one of the images or both images then we will ask the patient to rotate the medox rod in the trial frame uh, and uh, do this until both lines are seen as parallel and the degree to which he will rotate uh, the medox rod we can measure it using the trial frame scale and uh, this degree will give you uh, the degree of uh, torsion present either in torsion or extorsion so if two parallel lines are seen uh, without rotating the medox rod uh, then uh, it will indicate that there is no circular torsion present however if there is a tilt present in any of uh, one of the line, let's pause uh, in this session. Then it indicates that there is intorsion or extorsion present. And the patient will then rotate the medox rod. And the direction of rotation of medox rod will give you an indication whether uh, it is intorsion or extorsion. Uh, if the patient rotates medox rod, uh, let's suppose this is his right eye and this is left eye so we have arranged it in a vertical fashion medox rod if he rotates medox rod in this direction like that then we know that when the eye moves inward and upward it is in torsion that will indicate to you that patient has in torsion in this eye and if the patient uh, moves the medox rod in this direction towards the outside then it indicates that patient has extorsion and you can measure the degree let's suppose uh, it was present initially on 90 degrees and if the patient rotates medox rod and you read the reading it becomes 80 degree 
then it indicates that there is a 10 degree of intortion.